है समथिंग इज नॉट फीलिंग राइट वॉट द हेल मैन कहा होटल था देखो फ्रेंकली स्पीकिंग शायद कुछ ना हो बट स्ट्रेंज थिंग्स हैपन ऑन दिस स्ट्रेच स्ट्रेंज जस्ट स्ट्रेंज थिंग्स दैट डू नॉट हैव एन एक्सप्लेनेशन आई लुक एट द रियर व्यू मिरर एंड इट फेल लाइक Hello guys and welcome back to my channel and today we are starting on a trip towards Kolwa which is the southern part of Goa we are starting in our car and we'll be joined by our friends Harish and Rupa so we'll uh, quickly go down load all our luggages and get started and then I'll introduce you to the two other people who are joining us for the trip so stay tuned and now is the time for the most difficult part of the trip that is loading the luggage onto the car always the most difficult one all right guys so 250 kilometers done rasta kafi acha hi tha overall bus bumpers hote hain karnataka ke roads mein so so far so good and uh, this is a car and there are my friends and this is a small village road that we have parked in and this is my friend harish harish say hi This is Rupa. That's Megla. So we are continuing towards Vijayapura, uh, which is around 150 kilometers from here. Uh, about 250 kilometers done. This is the route that goes via Gulbarga. We have already crossed Gulbarga, and uh, so far so good. So let's continue. See ya. Right, so 35 kilometers away from Vijayapura, beautiful spot with a lot of windmills around. <laughs> All right, guys. So we just reached Vijayapura, and we have stopped by this uh, S Hyper Mart that's behind me. and we'll have a lunch here that was the plan and it is around 3:30 in the afternoon so let's get inside and have some good food and then we'll continue towards kolwa all right so we have just started and uh, we're leaving vijayapura so if you are heading or if you are visiting this place you can visit this restaurant that we stopped at i'll share the I will share the location details in the description and proceeding ahead we will be heading towards Tharwar which is near Hubli and uh, if you are coming this way you can stop at this particular restaurant it's really nice it's a very decent place and uh, food quality is also very nice All right guys so we are around 30 35 km away from Hubli and it's around 8:20 in the evening or night whatever you call it So we're gonna approach Goa or Kolwa through the the Molem route. So Molem is a place near Goa. So it has a very good, very spectacular ghat section. So we're gonna do that in the darkness. I hope we have a good experience, and we're just taking a small bio break, and after that we start again. हाईवे 
there are these crazy rumbler strips that hit the car very hard. So that is one issue that we are facing. Alright guys, so we are heading towards a place called Londa and post that we will be heading towards Molem. As you can see we took a, we took the bypass from Hubli to Dharwar and then we took a left turn towards Londa. The route is pretty isolated, there are some shops here and there, the road conditions are nothing to be talked about. While we took the bio break, ठीक है? तुम यहाँ पे थी? ठीक है? हाँ, तुम यहाँ पे थी left में? I looked at the rear view mirror and it felt like someone on a white color hoodie या white color कुछ भी t-shirt type का होगा, just पीछे खड़ा था और फट से निकल गया, और कोई नहीं था पीछे। देखो frankly speaking, शायद कुछ ना हो, but strange things happen. On this stretch, strange, just strange things that do not have an explanation. Just suddenly, your phone is not charged. Now, it's not charged. And that cable is also just fine. It's like that. With our bikes, we have to go to the whole day. Everything was fine. Suddenly, the headlamp is closed. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. The best part of this area is that there is no oncoming traffic. Is there no one from there? Who doesn't come from this time? People don't take this road, simple as that. It's a road not taken. It's a road not taken. Let's go and get a gun and what? Two people are sitting in front of me. Attention is taking attention. I don't think it's done. 
निकाल देंगे भाई मुझे भी डर लगता है मैं तो नीट निकलने वाला देखते हैं पहले बता रहा हूँ बीच में जाके थोड़ा डेंस हो जाएगा So we just crossed a forest check post where we were informed that this road is closed for tourists after 6 p.m. in the evening. Probably that is the reason why it did not have any other vehicle um, traveling on this road or flying on this road. Nevertheless, uh, we had to talk the person out, and we are through. ये वही point है जहाँ पे हम bike से आए थे. Okay. और हम बाइक साइड से लेके गए थे याद है सामने बैठ के चाय की थी ये पूरा रास्ता में था right. Right. और हम लोग इसी जगह से आए थे हम ऐसे आए थे ऐसे आए थे राइट तो मतलब ये जो हम लोग यूटर्न मारे ना यूटर्न ही मारे थे हम लोग स्ट्रेट आए थे पीछे से स्ट्रेट ये मोलम स्टार्ट हुआ फिर से एक वो है क्या देखते हैं क्या बोलते हैं ऑल गाइस सो वी आर एंटरिंग मोलम सम हाउ वी मैनेज इट एंड वी आर थ्रू द घाट रीजन स्टार्ट्स फ्रॉम हियर रिक्वेस्ट करके और अरे देख बाबा सबको पता सबको सब पता है सबको सब पता है राइट नाउ वी शुड एंजॉय द एक्सपीरियंस ठीक है बाकी सब क्या तेल लाने क्लाउड एंड बारिश का कॉम्बिनेशन है मॉलम कुछ ऐसा होता है घाट फॉर यू गाइज एंड दिस इज वॉट जीरो विजिबिलिटी लुक्स लाइक ऑल राइट इट्स टॉक अबाउट दिस सेटिंग सो The air conditioning or the aircon setting is at the windshield, which is the last set over here. It's at full heat, and the air conditioning is on, so it's dry, hot air towards the windscreen. That's the best setting to keep your glass, your windshield, fog-free. Coming us with heavy downpour. All right, guys. So it's uh, 3:18 in the night, and we are in Kolwa. Just three minutes to reach our stay for tonight and the following days as well. Uh, we all are very tired. Uh, most of them are asleep, and I even have to work tomorrow. So. It's gonna be a little difficult for me. But let's see how it goes.
Hello guys, good morning. This is the next day and we reached around 3.20 in the night um, and uh, unfortunately there was no one at the reception and we had to wait about 45 minutes to one hour uh, near the reception after which we had to uh, find out our contact number and find the manager and then we got our rooms. So we were extremely tired. I could not end the vlog. So yes, uh, that's about it. Um, the journey was fine. It was an 18 hours drive approximately. It was a little tiring due to the road conditions and the weather condition was also very extreme uh, and nearing to the, nearing the end of the journey. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you liked the journey. If you did, do give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family who might like or enjoy such videos. If you're new to the channel, do consider subscribing. If you're new to the channel, do consider subscribing. Don't subscribe to the channel. Thanks again. Bye bye. Take care.